I'm Rob Stapleton for your Alaska Aviation Link, and tonight we're going to talk to Mark Barker, who has a Christian Eagle, who's going to do some aerobatics for us and explain why. Flying in Alaska is exhilarating and sometimes terrifying for passengers. But it's not unusual for an aircraft to be pitched or rolled into an unusual attitude, nose down or rolled over on one wing in turbulence or while flying in the mountains. Mark Barker has some advice for pilots. Obviously you want to do aerobatics with a good trained instructor and you want to do it in an aircraft that you can do aerobatics and you don't want to go out in your Cessna caravan and start doing aerobatics. It's a great thing for everybody to know. You don't have to drive around upside down all the time like I do, but it helps you learn how to get out of a maneuver if you inadvertently get yourself into a maneuver. If you inadvertently find yourself upside down due to wind, wind gust or anything, you're real comfortable at just rolling the thing back right side up. Recently, we visited with Mark about building experimental aircraft. In this edition, Mark is going to demonstrate some aerobatics with his Christian Eagle. Aileron rolls, I did a couple wing overs. The ceiling was low enough, I couldn't do a loop. I didn't do any spins. We only got about 3,500 feet of altitude right now, and, and then of course some high speed passes and one low speed pass. Don't be alarmed. Take some advice from an old, bold pilot and get with a qualified instructor in aircraft before attempting any of these maneuvers. Don't go try to do it all by yourself. Don't try to teach yourself. Get a good instructor. You don't want to just figure it out all by yourself, although a lot of people do, I wouldn't recommend it. So remember, if you've got an airplane and you want to do aerobatics to get with an instructor, but not to be afraid of tipping over because the airplane will pull out of it if you know how. I'm Rob Stapleton for your Alaska Aviation Link.